In Tableau, a story is a sequence of visualizations that work together to convey information. Stories can be used to tell a data narrative, provide context, or demonstrate how decisions relate to outcomes. A story can be built out of dashboards, visualizations, or a combination of them both. The story we will build here is about a fictitious data viz cafe coffee shop that sells drinks, food, and merchandise and has 24 locations in Connecticut. A story in Tableau works by adding a dashboard of visualization to several separate sheets. A user will then navigate through the sheets in a sequence. Tableau offers several options to navigate through the story, as shown in the layout options that include caption boxes, numbers, dots, or arrows only. We will use captions here. Next, there are several options for adjusting the size of the story. We will choose from a, the list of predefined layout options, selecting generic desktop. However, if this size isn't optimal for the story, it can be adjusted by changing the custom width and height boxes. Next, we can begin building the content of the story by dragging our dashboard onto the work area. We can also refine the size of the story further if needed to display our dashboard fully. Before continuing to build our story, we can add a caption text to the navigation box at the top of our story. This text will provide a user some additional information when navigating through the story. The next step to build our story is to add a new story point. We can do this by clicking on either blank to start fresh or duplicate to copy an existing story point. We will choose blank and drag our menu item sales visualization onto the sheet. We will also add text to the caption. Finally, we will add another blank sheet and drag food and drink versus non-food visualization onto the sheet and add that caption text. We can test our story by clicking on the captions or arrows to navigate through the story. The final step before finishing our story is to give it a meaningful title. This can be done by renaming the tab for the story, which will be used for the story title text. Finally, we can click on the present icon and preview our finished story in presentation mode. 